Hey there and welcome to another Dave Does video. Today we are checking out the band Nightwish and the song is Harvest. Uh, so, uh, I checked out Nightwish and the song Noise not that long ago. Uh, and it was a little bit... How did I feel about the track? Now, I felt that the song or the, the track itself hadn't... Didn't show huge movement away from their last album. That's not a criticism. It's just an observation to me. So I sat there and felt that the song could quite comfortably sit on their last album and it wouldn't feel out of place. Uh, so I'm intrigued to see how Harvest sits. I wasn't saying the last that Noise wasn't a good song. It is a good song. It was just an observation. So a lot of people kind of got a little bit funny with me over that one. For some strange reason, people are a little bit defensive. Ah, no, Nightwish fans are never defensive. Actually, not the most defensive ones. There are a few other fans out there that are a lot more defensive of their band. Uh, anyway, if you like the video, please do subscribe, click the bell icon, like, share, leave the comments down below, like, get involved in the challenges. We have the originals versus covers, and of course, we have the greatest song ever. These are challenges that are currently live on the channel. Details of which are down below. If you want to support the channel, there are a couple of ways, or four ways to be precise that you can do this. We have the Patreon. We have the uh, priority video requests we have the uh, right inside craft shop and of course we have the band camp for the band nothing gained where you can support us by purchasing albums from my old band if you want to check out some of the music I'm currently working on please check out project 42 via reverb nation right uh, this will be a score reaction so score out of 10 10 categories details of which can come whizzing across the bottom of the screen okay count it in 3 2 1 go Yeah, it's a cool intro. My harvest will come, tiny valorous straw among the millions facing to the sun. Different. I will pause before a man whose path has just begun. Something unsung awakens. The cold. Over crops and a child's face of glow before the side. Join the harvest of hundred fields, hearty and tame, all going back to one single grain. Offer light to the coming day, inspire a child, water the fields, surrender to the earth. Water the fields, surrender to the earth. Water the fields, surrender to the earth. They have beauty beyond the poetry, but choose a silent misery. The deeper the sea, the less remains. They'll find the pretty words and tame flocks to birth. There's that sort of arousal of death. Join the It's only really in the chorus that you really hear the nightwish elements to it. It's very cool. So this is getting more of a little bit of a Nightwish vibe, the piano playing here. I mean, a little bit more to what I would kind of class as the classic Nightwishy sort of style and sound. Nice bass tone. Okay, now we're getting the Nightwish vibe. <laughs>
great potato, just nice full weight, leaving for all the rest of the instrumentation. I love how the track is just constantly building. I think this is going to be a good big song live, it feels like. It's got to be hard for them to pick a set list. Okay, so that was Nightwish and Harvest. Great track, really enjoyed it. Um, I should have said that with more than conviction there, shouldn't I? Really enjoyed it, that was amazing. Um, what's my thoughts overall? So, really like the lyrics, because um, sometimes with Nightwish lyrics, they can kind of be a bit subjective they can be a kind of like we're gonna make you really work to understand it this was nice it was it kind of told a story it invited you in to kind of take your own interpretation slightly on it but it still kind of gave you a very kind of got, kind of got you 80 percent there almost uh so i liked that really nice melody great little hook to the track uh over the chorus and i have to say I mean, when i when the verse was going on you, if someone had been playing that to me and hadn't told me it was Nightwish, I wouldn't have guessed it was Nightwish. Uh, just because vocally it didn't naturally sound what you normally hear. It was much milder. It was much calmer. Um, it was just a very chilled. It was just kind of almost like a, a folky song. Uh, it didn't have a lot of what we would expect the big Nightwish elements to be. So the certain keyboard sound that had been replaced with a more piano-y bass piece which is similar to what you hear on, obviously, things like The Great Show on Earth, etc. has that similar sort of tone uh, for the piano on that. Uh, and it was only really on the chorus that you start to get a little bit more of the vibe of it being a Nightwish trap. And then when you then got into the whole kind of... It's not, I wouldn't call it a solo section. It was the multiple lead different parts where everyone took a different lead. Um, then you kind of got all the more of the elements kicking in and the drums kicked in, the guitars kicked in, and then you kind of go, yeah, that sounds like Nightwish. Now that's giving me more of a Nightwish vibe. Uh, and it just kept building. I love the fact it kept building and building and building. And then it kind of had that little pause and then back into the chorus. Um, and I definitely see this as being a big crowd please alive. It's just got a nice hook to it and it's, it's a sing-along song. Uh, and works really really well so really enjoyed it but let me know what you think in the comments below if you like the video please do subscribe click the like on like share leave the comments and that of course is how dave does it <laughs>